Welcome everyone, Farmer Cop here. This is going to be the top 10 mods of the week for all platforms. So everything we're going to go over today is going to be available for all platforms. So we're going to go ahead and jump right into it. All right, for number one this week, we have the Swather Pack. This is by BC Bueller. This is 19.74 megabytes to download for all platforms. Currently rated 4.8 out of 5 stars with 265 people having rated it. This thing is absolutely fantastic. So um, I really like the Heston version, which is the one you're seeing out here. And that front attachment it has on it is a mower conditioner. What that means is if you're trying to make hay, if you mow with that specific implement there, it will bypass the tedding process. All you have to do is mow the grass and you'll get hay. So it's a one step process there. But if we take a look in the store at this pack here, again, you have the Swather itself, 100,000 to buy. You can go up here and you can adjust the brand to Case, Challenger, Heston, Massey Ferguson, and then back to Case. You can adjust some wheel options in there as well. Here is the conditioner, which again, you can do whatever brand you need to do for that. And then we have this guy right here, which is just going to be a regular old mower. Um, it will also cut different crop types as well. Um, so that way you can do that if you wanted to. You're going to get straw usually from them. You're not going to get the actual crop types on a harvester. So just be aware of that. And then we also have a transport trailer to be able to transport um, the various headers around with this thing. So yeah, this is the Swather pack. And I think this is a fantastic mod. And I'm excited to have a Swather actually in game that works well. So there you go, the Swather pack. For number two this week, we have the Water Distributor. This is by D3R Joe. Uh, this is 0.45 megabytes to download for all platforms. Currently rated 4.8 out of five stars, with so 64 people having rated it. To place this, you're gonna get it in your production chains, and it works like a production chain. And honestly, a lot of you guys are probably like, why do we care about a water distributor? Well, I'll explain why you might want this. This is a place where you can put in up to um, 500,000 liters of water. That's the capacity listed for it. So you can put 500,000 liters of water in here. And then if we go into our main menu and we go down to productions, we can set this here to distributing. And then so you're gonna put water in here and it will distribute it out. And what it's gonna do is basically fill all your greenhouses or other production chains that require water. So if you have 20 greenhouses, all you have to do is put water in this one facility and it will provide water to all of your greenhouses. So really useful mod here, um, fantastic work on this. I think this is uh, great and very useful and I think a lot of people end up using it and it's only $5,000 to buy. So really not that expensive either, but there you go. That is the water distributor. All right, for number three, this is Griffin, Indiana 22. What you're seeing on your screen is part of my map tour of this map. This is an amazing American map, probably one of the best American maps that we had on FS19. It'll probably be one of the best that we're gonna have on FS22 as well. This is by AJ Farmer. It's 188.66 megabytes to download. It is available for all platforms and currently rated 4.4 out of five stars with 441 people having rated it. Uh, if you wanna check out a full detailed tour of this map, uh, make sure you guys hit that card that's gonna pop up on your screen right now so you can go check out my map tour of it. But there you go, that is Griffin, Indiana 22. All right, for number four, we have the Case 821G. This is by uh, Ferdaza and BTFTP. 35.84 megabytes to download for all platforms. Currently rated 4.8 out of five stars with 129 people having rated it. Um, yes, it just, at the end of the day, it just is a wheel loader at the end of the day. So it's just what it is. But there's some cool options on it. So if we take a look at it actually in the store here, we have the wheel loader itself, which again, you can go in here and you can change the color to anything you want. And there's a lot of other different customizations through here that you can change up as you want to. So a lot of customizations there. This pack also includes the 821G bucket, which has a 3,600 liter bolt capacity for any of these crops pallet forks, log forks, and the high dump bucket, which has a 3,500 liter capacity for all these guys right here. So a lot of really good details on these things. Fantastic, well done. That is the Case 821G, which again, yeah, it is just another wheel loader, but as much customization as you can do for this, um, this is a really cool thing to have in game. So there you go. All right, for number five, we have the Lizard PCP 6000 Sugar Cane Planter. This is by Senior Vertex and ZT Modding. 16.07 megabytes to download for all platforms. Currently rated 4.9 out of five stars with 105 people having rated it. Now, yes, at the end of the day, it is just another sugarcane planter, but there's some really good benefits to this guy right here, and I'll show you guys those in the store. So if you hop in here and go under this, there's two in this pack, there's the automated, and then there's the PCP 6000. This one, you have to do some stuff from in this cab here. Um, so if you want it all to just kind of be automated, I'd recommend this guy right here. But regardless, if you come into here, you have the original three meter working width, so it's gonna be this wide here, or you can bump that up. Six meters, unrealistic six meters or eight meters or 11 up to all the way up to 11 right there and then back down to three so with that unrealistic um working with there that gives you a lot of different capabilities with it in addition to that the seeding capacity of this thing is 24,000 plus seeds that this thing's gonna be able to hold so um, a lot of seed capacity for you so you can get out there and get after it especially at 11 meters for a long period of time so there you go that is the lizard pcp 6000 sugarcane planter next up we have bakuri farm 
2K22, which is going to be number six for us this week. On your screen, you're seeing part of my map tour of it. This is a map by Lost Gamer. This is 172.15 megabytes to download for all platforms, currently rated 4.4 out of five stars with 386 people having rated it. Um, this is a really cool, really well done map and definitely worth checking out. Um, I do have a map tour of it, as I just mentioned, um, which their card is going to pop up on the screen right now if you want to go check out the full tour and see if this is a map that you might be interested in playing on. But again, it's very well rated and very well downloaded or in terms of a map that's just been out for a few days. So make sure you guys go check this one out. Bakuri Farm 2K22. All right, for number seven, we have the New Holland CR IntelliSense series by Egritono. This is 14.98 megabytes to download for all platforms. Currently rated 4.9 out of five stars with 142 people having rated it. This is a very customizable harvester. As you can see, we have some tracks out there. We have it numbered on the side. Um, there is a huge grain capacity, um, engine configurations, everything you can imagine with things single, a ton of different configuration options. So especially for you guys out there that are uh, New Holland fans, this thing is fantastic. The base price is 325,000 and it goes up from there as you customize it. But make sure you guys check out this fantastic harvester, the New Holland CR IntelliSense. All right, for number eight, we have the field work fill station. This is by GMN G Joy. This is 2.19 megabytes to download for all platforms. Currently 4.9 out of five stars with 68 people having rated it. This thing is a fill point for seeds, fertilizer, lime, liquid fertilizer, herbicide, and silage additive. It is $15,000 to buy and it has a daily upkeep of $2. The benefits to this, there are two versions available. There is one that's the Fieldwork Fill Station with a 25% discount for buying bulk. So you get 25% off all of those different fill types I listed. And there's another option that is the free Fieldwork Fill Station, which will give you, yes, free stuff. So you get free seeds, fertilizer, lime, liquid fertilizer, herbicide, and silage additive from it if you want to do that. So if you just wanted something where you can just go pick that stuff up or you need it for free for whatever reason, or you just want to get a discount on it and purchase this bad boy, um, really good deal on there for you um, and really good mod. So there you go. That is the field work fill station by GMNG Joy. All right, for number nine, we have Adding Him Park, another map this week. This is by GB Modding, and what you're seeing on your screen is part of my map tour. Um, this thing is 509.23 megabytes, which is a huge download for a map, but this thing is extremely well detailed and is available for all platforms. This thing only has a 4.1 out of 5 star rating, but to be fair, that's a pretty good rating for a map with 277 people having rated it, but it definitely deserves a much higher rating. Um, there are a lot of different, uh, you can see hedges on the map. You can turn the collisions off on those if you'd like to at the store so that way you don't have to worry about running into them. As I know that's a big obstacle for some people trying to play maps that are similar to this. So just be aware of that. But if you wanted to check out the full map tour, make sure you guys hit that card that's up on your screen right now. So that way you guys can check out my map tour on it and see if this is the map you wanna take a look at. But there you go, adding him park. All right, for number 10 and our final mod for the day, this is the Cursoni Compact. 10. This is by SMI Modding Team, 13.30 megabytes to download for all platforms, currently rated 4.9 out of 5 stars, with 86 people having rated it. It is not the Harvester, it is that Cressoni header you see in front, and you might ask, well, why is the Harvester header like that matter? Well, the cool thing about the Cressoni headers is how it folds up. You can see it folded up on the Harvester right here, but in reality, this is actually a 7.8 meter working width. Uh, harvester header so you can need your corn and sunflowers or this thing at 7.8 meters but if you wanted to just leave it on the harvester and drive down the road with it folded up like that you can do so without having to bother with header trailers so uh, there you go um, fantastic mod really well detailed and I think very useful in terms of the game so there you guys go but that is going to be it for me today if you guys enjoyed this video please drop a like down below if you haven't already hit that subscribe button up on the screen to join the farmer cop channel and turn on your notification bell so you don't miss any future videos that I may post this has been Farmer Cop. Thank you guys for coming and watching the top 10 mods of the week.